Yes, my friends, I bought a Mini 2 and I couldn't be more excited. The package arrived today and inside I have the new DJI Mini 2 drone with the Fly More combo. Let's check it out. So when opening the package, we are greeted with this shoulder bag. And I guess everything is nicely and tightly packed inside. And without even opening the package, I can tell you that it has quite a nice quality and I believe it should protect the drone during travels. Let's see what's inside. So the bag has some nice padding inside it feels quite premium so in the bag we have a remote controller This feels really premium and it seems to have dedicated buttons for some of the aircraft's features. So it has a mode select switch to change between flight modes. A scroll to adjust the tilt angle of the camera. Return to home button battery indicator and power on off button on the top it has an adjustable holder for your phone and here is the cable that connects to your phone it also has a dedicated button for photo video And on the bottom it holds the two control sticks, allowing a safer and easier transport. These seem to be made of aluminum, so it's quite nice, it feels premium. And of course a USB Type-C for charging the remote. Let's set this aside and move on to the rest of the accessories so here we have another box it says accessories on top so inside we have a two-way charging hub this is for charging your batteries it already has two intelligent flight batteries connected so DJI says that this fly more combo has three batteries included so the third one should be in the drone so using this you can charge your batteries and also charge your mobile devices while the batteries are inside it has a power button, an input port and an output USB port and it can use a 5V 3A 
9 volt 3 amp or 12 volt 3 amp input. Then we also get an 18 watt charger. So this outputs 5 volts at 3 amps, 9 volts at 2 amps or 12 volts at 1.5 amps. We have two more RC cables. So these are for USB type C and micro USB. So you will easily find a suitable one for your mobile device. And the last thing that we get in the box is a USB type A to type C cable. What else? Then we get, I guess, some documentation here. It has a nice seal on top. So in this we have the quick start guide. A flyer. Some information about the charging hub. Some warnings in French. And some safety guidelines in various languages. And last but not least, a small, compact, lightweight and supposedly easy to fly aircraft. So this is my first interaction with a DJI product and feels like a quality product. So it has this nice propeller guard which should keep the propellers from moving around while transporting the aircraft. On the side there are some stickers telling you the order at which you should unfold the arms of the aircraft. Here is a sheet of A4 paper for comparison. Let me remove the stickers so we can check it out. The drone's main features are an ultralight body of 249 grams with foldable arms, a maximum of 31 minutes of flight time, a maximum of 10 km video transmission using OcuSync 2.0, a level 5 wind resistance, meaning winds of up to 10.5 meters per second, and a 4K 3-axis gimbal stabilized camera. So besides the aircraft, we have some spare propellers, individually packed, which is really nice. Some spare control sticks. Oh, 
a small screwdriver and that's it thanks for watching guys in my next video I will take the drone for a test to see how well it handles how the camera performs and how easy it is to fly this aircraft till next time take care